Many times you're working on a project and you've made a mistake that you want to undo. Well, you have an undo button, but there's another option. Come up here to where you've saved your presentation and below the title, all the way at the bottom, you'll see version history. So here's a file that I'm going to make some significant changes on. Again, I can change the title, where this file is downloaded to, I can see when it was last saved, or here I can see my version history. So let's update this file. I'm going to fast forward just a little bit. So now I've made some changes to my presentation and I'm going to add another slide. I'm going to insert a new slide and add some things. Every time I'm making updates to my PowerPoint presentation, you can see that it is saving up at the top. This is the online version that is auto saving. So now I've added a few new things. Now in my presentation, I can come up to the title and view version history. And here I can see the version that is current just now. And I could save a copy or download it if I want, or I can see one from 46 minutes ago. That's when this file was originally created. So now I have an option to save a copy of past work, or I can choose restore. When I choose restore, it's now putting the original version of this file from 47 minutes ago back. So any of the changes that I made since then will be erased. You should be aware that if you're collaborating with any other person, that any changes that you make on this document will change it for everybody.